Tell me I'm pretty. You're pretty. Thank you. Hi, I'm Ben. Welcome to Video Marketing Unscripted, where I answer your video marketing questions completely unprompted. And then Anthony makes me look good by editing and all kinds of fixing it in post and whatnot. Anthony, what's our question today? Well, Ben, today's question is from Jacob at NC State, and it's in two parts. Hi, Ben. Hi. Anybody call you Benny the Jet Rodriguez? Yes, but um, the courts have forbade me to talk about that, so... I... Follow-up question. Which platform do you prefer to host a video on? YouTube, Vimeo, Wistia, or somewhere else? Okay, that's a good question. I, I'm gonna go to my old standard here and say it depends. Um, YouTube is fantastic for uh, kind of like a video search engine. So I would definitely get content that is going to help people do things or find your company, and I'd put that on YouTube. So if it's like a how-to video or maybe like certainly a brand awareness piece, Something like that you can put on YouTube, people will actually find it, and then you want to direct them to your site. I think that's the best way to use YouTube. Now, Vimeo is also really nice in that it's kind of more for video creators traditionally, but now they've kind of got some more advanced analytics for businesses. So it's nice that you have a little bit more control over the video player when you embed it on your site. So Vimeo is kind of a nice... Uh, not YouTube search engine generating piece, but it's kind of a nice looking player that gives you decent analytics depending on what level of service you have with them. Now, we use Wistia, and we use Wistia because it has even more advanced analytics, and it's really designed for companies to do lead generation. You can build turnstiles, which is where you can actually ask for someone's email address to either subscribe to a series like this one, or get their information so that they could even potentially watch the rest of a video. I wouldn't start a video that way necessarily, but maybe put it somewhere in the middle at kind of a tension point and then you capture their information and then they can watch the rest of the video. So there's some cool things that Wistia can do. Very robust analytics. The dashboard isn't the best, but all the information's there and fantastic integrations with like Marketo and HubSpot and Pardot. And then I, I think anything else is really gonna get more expensive. So you got options like Vidyard and Brightcove that, that again have more advanced uh, abilities like uh, integrating with more platforms and, and kind of for more enterprise level stuff. So, so again, I think it depends. Each platform has its advantages and, and I hope I've kind of highlighted them. So uh, Jacob, I hope that answers your second question anyway. And if you've got a video marketing question you'd like me to answer, put it in the comments below or fill out the form on our site. You're welcome.